inside my own world of make believe. Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities. I see the world through ice covered in ink and bleach. Cross out the ones who help my cries and watch me weep. I love everything. Fire spreading all around my room. My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's alright. Hush. I have a slab of white oak here. Don't mind the top. Uh, this is, you know, probably probably five inches at its thickest, and then it's about half as thick down at the bottom. Uh, but it is all of um, nine feet, and this is just way beyond my capacity to lift by myself. But uh, nevertheless, I still want the lumber. So as you can see, I've got a, uh, a pretty substantial um, slab of white oak here. And this thing is just well beyond my capacity to lift by myself. Um, I've had good luck tipping slabs up and then walking them over. This is not the kind of weight that you want to be doing that with. Um, and so it, it's not safe to tip up and walk. If somebody had a lumber cart, that would be great. But uh, if you have the ability to maneuver some of your equipment around your site, uh, this is how you can think creatively and uh, move really heavy things by yourself. So here's what we're gonna do. You know, there comes a point in, uh, in every big job like this where I think to myself, what have you gotten into? This is insane. What are you doing? And for me, it's right now, I have finagled this three inch thick slab of white oak. It's, my guess is nine feet long. I have finagled it so that it is just resting up on my tailgate. And uh, the next step is to just gut it up, push it into the tailgate. So let's see, let's see what we got left in the tank.
What am I caught up now? Probably the overestimation of my capabilities. something off. Time to tie it down. <laughs> 